Hey guys, I'm seeing Greta Van Fleet for the fourth time today and I'm so excited. So I'm gonna do a little get ready with me and vlog. I did this for my first show ever that I went to of theirs last year and everyone seemed to really enjoy it. So I thought I'd make another one. I'm seriously so excited. I went to the first night of Nashville last year, and then the second night of Bridgeport, and then I went to Grand Rapids in March. All were such different experiences, and I think this experience tonight will be another different experience, and I'm just really excited to see how it goes. Also, as you can tell, it's literally pitch black outside because it is currently like two or three in the morning. Um, I just got up like a half hour ago and got a shower because I need to start getting ready now because we have a three hour drive and we are trying to get there by like 6.30 or 7 just to like keep an eye out. The venue like doesn't allow people on their property until 8 a.m. But I really don't trust that people are going to listen because in the past venues have said that they're closing everything off and then like proceeded to like not close everything off and let people, they like let people camp all night. So we're just going to like go early and just check and see what's going on and hopefully we can get to be one of the first people in line because that would be crazy. I really want barricade for them. Um, I think I would like actually die if I got barricade. Please manifest for me. Even though I'm gonna be posting this after the show, please manifest for me that I get barricade. Okay, so I currently have on like the pants that I'm wearing tonight. Here's what they look like, they're from Target. And then I have a black bralette on, but I'm not wearing that. I have a black long sleeve shirt that I'm wearing, which I honestly might get too hot. But if I get too hot, like before I go in, I'll try to find a place to change and I'll probably just change into like this or like a different black bralette. The fit today is really cute, so I can't wait for you guys to see it. Also, this concert was supposed to happen in March, so that's why I bought a long sleeve shirt for it. I feel like I spent the money on that shirt, and it's really cute, and I feel like I shouldn't change it up. This is the shirt that I was talking about. It's like really like flowy here, and I think it's really cute. It shouldn't be too bad, because it's not like it's cropped pretty short, so let's hope I'm okay. For the jewelry, I just have my basic Claire's rings that I wear like every day that are getting all crusty and gross. And then I have this like crystal bracelet, this crystal necklace, so cute. And then some hoops, some gold hoops. These two guitar picks are from my other two favorite bands. So like, wouldn't it just be like amazing if I got one tonight? So I'm gonna have her do like my eyeshadow and then I'll just put on mascara because she told me that she thinks that if I put on eyeliner, I'm gonna like sweat it all off. <laughs> so the makeup is complete. It's literally just gold eyeshadow. I really like it. Um, obviously I did gold because the dreams and gold tour and also that's why my pants are gold obviously also I don't think I'm gonna do anything with my hair I'm just gonna like let it dry and then like fluff these pieces out in the front like I always do um I feel like I literally never do anything with my hair and I feel really lame for that but I feel like my natural hair looks really good compared to anything else that I've ever done with my hair so right now I think I'm gonna film some TikToks of the fit because I know that people on my Greta Van Fleet account probably really wanna see it. So let's go do that. So I filmed the TikToks and we're about to leave. We're packing up the car right now. Um, yeah, I'm so excited. Ah. I'm already kind of sweating in my outfit, so I'll probably have to change, but at least I can get cute pictures in the outfit. Okay, so we're in the car, and we are about to leave. It is currently 3.46 in the morning, and we'll probably get there around, like, what time? Let's just say 7. 7, yeah. So, uh, yeah. I'll see you whenever. We're currently at Sheets getting gas and my sister ran in to get snacks. 
so hopefully she gets us some really good snacks um i realized i didn't show you guys the cardboard cutouts that i made so here they are here's jake here's danny sammy josh i'm really proud of those hashtag age of machine vibes we just tried to get burger king and they weren't open how wrong is that look at the sunset I mean the sunrise. <laughs> Hi, so we're at the venue and people are just kind of like driving in and they're not supposed to So we don't really know what's going on But we saw people with like numbers on their hands. I don't know. Here's the thing. Okay, give me give me give me the camera Seriously. First of all people are driving into the venue But like we're not allowed to be here until 8 and you have to drive through these things I don't know if you can see them, but you have to drive through them to pay for parking Well, there's no one in the booths yet, so you can't pay for parking so if you go through them, I'm afraid that if we go through them, we're gonna like get towed or like get a ticket since we didn't pay for parking. And you oh should God, like respect on. that the venue says that you can get here at eight, like go through the engine to um, Well, hopefully we actually like get a good spot in line. It's currently 7.32 and they're supposed to let us in at eight. So hopefully they actually do. Okay, bye. Okay, so I look a little rough right now because I've been waiting outside since eight o'clock in the morning but i haven't really updated you guys because um as soon as it turned eight i sprinted into the venue to wait in line and there were already like 150 people there which i don't get they must have been there before they were supposed to be which is kind of annoying but whatever it's four right now so yeah it's raining out and i'm kind of like soaked right now but it's okay i got glitter for my hair if you can even see it but i'm so excited i think since we're like 150th in line i think we'll probably be second or third row hopefully or maybe even barricade who knows any of those is fine with me i would have preferred barricade but second or third row is still amazing i will update you after the show and let you know how it goes
so it is currently the next day but for the most part i had like the best time ever i was like third or fourth row just being that close to them is such like a like an amazing experience like i just don't understand how they're real like they're just all so beautiful but i had a bad experience with like the people around me like they knew me because of my Greta Van Fleet TikTok account and they said that like I shoved one of them or something even though I literally just lifted my arm up and then they were like talking about like hitting me in the throat. One of them said that I didn't deserve to be in the front which like I like don't understand what I did but okay this is the peaceful army and I don't understand why half maybe not half but like some of the people at Greta shows are so like not peaceful. Like, please be peaceful, like, and respect people around you, and just, like, respect everything. It's not that hard. I met so many nice people in line and stuff, but, like, there's just, like, always a select few that, like, are, like, insane. But for the most part, I had the most amazing time ever. I might buy tickets for Allentown, maybe. I think I should do it. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, be prepared for more Greta vlogs in the future, because I'll definitely make them if people want to see them so yeah bye